You can hear the music out here in the parking lot. For 35 years, the Blue Wisp Big Band has called a couple of different places home. But for now, the Pirate's Den is the place to be on Wednesday nights. The music is pure, magical even, and it's definitely so Cincinnati. If it's a Wednesday night, you better believe the Blue Wisp Big Band is jamming. Members, many rock stars in their own right, create a sound so classic, so refined, and it's the reason the house is packed. But this is not your grandfather's big band, and that's evident looking across the crowd. Jazz lovers of all ages. You don't see improv in music anymore, and uh, I like jazz, jazz just because of that. Co-founder and drummer John Von Olin keeps the beat, and over the years, he says there hasn't been much change. It really caught on, and the band's good. You know, it's one of the best hometown bands you're going to find. I mean, there's New York and L.A., you know, but just about anywhere else, this is as good as it's going to get. They got their name at the Blue Wisp Jazz Club in the original home in O'Brienville. The club moved three times before closing in 2014. Then it was on to Japs on Main Street and over the Rhine. And now, the Pirate's Den in Bridgetown. I mean, we just come down whenever I'm free. Uh, she invites the whole family. As a band, they've made more than a dozen albums and traveled the world. Co-founder and tenor sax player Joe Gaudia still sees the passion in the band and in the crowd, too. We've been fortunate. Uh, it's a little different over in this because we've never been on the west side of the city before, uh, but we've gotten some new faces who never saw before that probably don't venture downtown where we mostly were before. Brad Underwood, Local 12 News.